Yo, what's up everyone? In today's video, I'll be showing you how to go from this to this. As you might already know, there are pros and cons to raising or lowering your FOV. Raising it will give you a wider field of view, effectively letting you see more on your screen and less perceived recoil. The downside is that trying to shoot people far away with iron sights or a smaller magnification sight might be more challenging since the enemies will appear to be smaller. Anyway, if you wish to try raising your FOV above the in-game limit, which is 110, then there are three ways you can go about doing it. The first and easiest way to do this is through your Steam launch commands. So just open your Steam library and navigate to Apex Legends, right click and go to properties. And then in the general tab in launch options, you can add plus CL underscore FOV scale and then 1.7. The maximum in-game FOV being 110 is an FOV scale of 1.55 and 1 1.7 is 120 FOV. You can also pick anything in between these two values. For example, I use FOV scale 1.66, which I'm guessing is around 117 FOV. So you can just choose whatever you'd like. Once you've put this in the launch options and you launch your game, every time the game launches, it will run this command, which will put your game into whatever FOV you want or 120 being 1.7. The second way to do this, which is the way I do it, is by going into the config files and changing it there. So what I do is I go to the search bar and I type in respawn. If you can't find it that way, then just go to local disk, C users, your name of the profile and your PC, saved games, respawn, and then apex, and then profile. And then you should have just one profile.cfg in here. And then open that. Then pretty much right at the top, you'll see the CL FOV scale command right here. Um, and if you're on 110 FOV, it should say 1.55 and just change this value in here to 1.7. Um, I won't be doing this because if I, if I save it, it won't, it won't do it. Um, but that's because when you just open it and you change it to 1.7 or whatever value you'd like, and then you save it, you want to save it, file, save, close it and then what I like to do is if you right click on the on the notepad and then properties and then attributes read only I check this so basically when I go in game and I change a setting that might affect my FOV like video settings or if I ac I guess accidentally change my FOV and it goes back to 110 or whatever if you close your game and then reopen it because this is on read only it doesn't change the value in your profile.cfg so it will reset to whatever you put it in there so if you put 1.7 which is 120 fov you launch your game you change your fov in game you close your game you reopen it it'll be back to 120 fov so this is the way i like to do it so yeah the third and final way to do this is through an auto exec i personally don't use an auto exec but i know a good amount of you do so i'll go through how to add it there as well so once you've created your auto exec and in your steam launch commands, you have plus exec space auto exec, then you can go into your local files, browse, CFG, and then in your auto exec, you want to open that. And then you just add the command line, CL underscore FOV scale 1.7. And, and then of course you need the, the, the bind for it. Uh, and that's all you need. So you, if you already have an auto exec with a bunch of stuff in here, you just add this line to it, save, close, and then you can open your game. And whenever you hit your bind to use your auto exec, it will go into 120 FOV. Uh, and that is how I did it at the start of the video. So like you saw at the start of the video, if you have the auto exec, see I'm on 110 FOV now. And then when I hit F12, it zooms out to 120 FOV and then if you change it back to 110 again and then F12 goes back to 120 so that is how you do it with the auto exec but yeah hope this video helped you if it did I'd appreciate a like comment or sub I also post YouTube shorts and TikToks every single day and go live once or twice a week on Twitch so if that interests you make sure to go follow my socials anyway have a good day peace